Hey guys, Pixel here, and welcome back to an episode of Minecraft Chronicles. Now, as you can see behind me, the kitchen that was originally here in the last episode when we had our birthday special is completely gone now, and I will get to that in a moment, and as you probably noticed by now, um, I am not exactly in the area where we left off in the last video, and originally that area was all the way, all the way right here. I have a little waypoint here so we can go back and check that out in a moment, because we did leave some avocados, like, well, they're... They're not ripe yet, so we couldn't exactly take them, but we did leave avocados there and some birds and stuff, and hopefully they laid a couple bird eggs or something for us while we were gone. But yeah, so I want to show you what I did in between videos. I didn't do a whole lot, but I did do just a little bit of work, so I got all of this stuff out of our kitchen, and I kind of organized it here and stuff, and, um, and I kind of started setting up a little area for an idea of how our new stuff is going to be set up. So I was thinking we could have like a kitchen here. And then we could have like a living room here and maybe like a dining room or something or maybe like a little living room over here and dining room here. I don't really know the whole plan and detail yet, but we will get into that eventually and hopefully in this video, if not definitely in the next one. But also I want to show you what I did upstairs. So obviously now there's this door here and this room is going to be our new bedroom. So I just built this little room here utilizing the windows that you can see that lead over like our um our chest room here and basically I just had like the vines and stuff from the bunny room and originally originally I did make this room with it being like our room on mine but then the bunnies kind of took over and I can't really get them out right now because there's nowhere to put them so I just decided you know I kind of want a bigger room anyway so I just made this one and moved the stuff from there into here so we have like a little closet area or something over here and beautiful windows and stuff and a really nice look out of like the whole animal farm which you can't really see with the blinds and the leaves in the way but you can kind of get a view of it if you jump up and down and also on the other side um all the way over here I dug out a little bit area starting for whatever we're gonna have over here but I stopped because I wanted to do some of it in between not in between like in the video because if I do all the work out of video then it's not as boring but if I do do work in the video, sometimes it can get boring, so I kind of want to mix it up in between, so do like half not boring, half boring, kind of, because then it's not as boring. Also, I fixed this area out here and made a little fence gate and stuff. I don't know why that turns green every time it's connected to the leaves. I don't know, but we're just going to leave that. Also, I added some chests here because this, this block had to go back one, and it kind of interfered with it not being there so yeah i just put those there and then oh also while i was digging this out i realized this cobblestone oak drawer of like the storage drawers it goes up to stack limit of 32 stacks which means we have 32 stacks of cobblestone in here and it's completely filled up and i ha i still have more cobblestone like on me and i can't even put it in so we're either gonna have to make another one of these these um storage drawers or there's this thing that's like a um it's some kind of weird, like, some kind of upgrade. Yeah, these things, like, storage upgrade. It was, like, two times its base value. And that, oh. Okay, that's a little bit, okay, that's, it's not too bad. But I was going to say, because it's a little bit kind of pricier, but two times, that's a, that's 64 stacks of cobblestone. And then we can go to, like, upgrade three, upgrade four. Or no, that's upgrade five. That's four. Okay, subsidians so four. Diamonds is five. Uh, emeralds is six, and then there is status upgrade, which is it shows full storage. Uh, we don't really need these ones, but we're we'll definitely have to get to that sometime soon because we're really gonna start running out of room for the cobblestone. But for right now, I'm thinking I'm just gonna dump it in this chest because you know this is kind of what it's for. It's a miscellaneous overflow chest of blocks. So let's head up stairs. Let's sleep in our new bedroom. I love saying that. Let's sleep in our new bedroom, and we will go check out the. Uh, oh, what is it called? Like, the eggs avocado area. So let's just teleport there. Um, because I did bring the ship back, the ship back to the house, and where are we? Oh, it's, what's that? This reminds me. We've been having a little bit of mod, mod, um, like, mods conflicting with each other, as we've seen with, like, the base adventure backpack backpack, and also the, uh, dog bed and doggy talents. So, you know, we're having a little bit of conflict issues, and I can't really fix them, because I don't know how, and I think this is one of, one of the conflicts. This wasn't, there's an owl egg? Uh, I'm gonna take that. 
But this is an hour, so but should we take it? What was placed here? Was it like one of these things that glitched out? So come oh. Are you laying eggs for me? I'm so confused, but a spawn egg and another owl egg. I'm just gonna take those and leave that there. Hopefully though <gasps> and these are done. But hopefully they will lay more eggs, but we just scored two owl eggs and a swan egg. One owl egg was probably glitched out from like grass or something and it really got messed up but you know that's fine i'm not complaining we got free stuff there oh there's pineapples up here let's just oh <gasps> they're tropical gardens from the oh what's it called the pentarus craft mod <gasps> so oh i didn't mean for that to burn but we just got so much more tropical stuff what is this egg incubator though what is it is it like a really is it like all diamonds to craft it because if it is i want to get rid of it if it's not i think we could do it ourselves oh you know that that's fine. We could we have that stuff at home. So I'm just gonna throw this into the lava because I don't want to really cheat in blocks. Um. Oh yeah. What am I doing? We can't exactly run home now, can we? Let's just teleport. I mean, we technically we can run home, but it'd be really hard to do that when we're trying to. Um. Where's my home? Here it is. I gotta remove. I gotta remove and clean out some of those waypoints. But it'd be really hard to try to run home when you have to run across the ocean. So, uh, yeah, that's all I really did in between videos, and today, um, originally I was talking about maybe possibly doing a, let's just throw this stuff in here, but maybe possibly doing a, um, you know, a, like, oh, what is it called? Like a, a what is it called? Like a, a dinosaur. That's what's called, the fossil archaeology mod video. Kind of like a Jurassic Parks thing. Thing about that, I want to wait for a SMS, which will be this upcoming Saturday, which will be coming up real soon. And so I'm thinking we're going to wait till then until we actually hatch an egg, a dinosaur egg, and we start again in that whole mod. So for right now, I think we're definitely going to explore a mod, but specifically a decoration mod. And no, I don't mean deco craft. I mean Mr. Crayfish Furniture Mod. That is a mod that we kind of started originally um, decorating a little with the house. Like we had some of like this stuff here. Well, this these tables are baby little craft, but we have like the coffee tables and this kind of fake TV because we didn't have the stuff to make a real TV. And then we have like these tables and chairs outside and stuff. So I think we should progress in that mod and really make our kitchen because I've been really wanting to do this since like, you know, what better time to actually do it. So right now I kind of set up a little area of just like wooden oak planks to mark out counter space and stuff. So let's check out what actual counters we have. I don't, I don't actually think we actually have counters. Oh no, we have kitchen counters. We it looks like they only come in quartz. Oh. Oh, does that only make one? Because that's kind of a hefty price. I mean, the quartz is kind of easier to get because we just have to go back to the nether, which is kind of kind of something I don't really want to have to do. But um, the clay may be a little harder to get. So, ooh. We could definitely do some of this. Wait, was that stone or iron? Okay, that's stone, thank God. But we could definitely do some of this in this video. So... We don't really have a bathroom, so the shower and bath and basin and toilet stuff, that kind of stuff doesn't really work for us right now. But one of the things we do have is this whole kitchen, and because we can't have the kitchen counters right now, which we'll eventually go, we'll eventually do that, but that's going to take a little while. And we can always upgrade our kitchen counters and stuff later. So for right now, let's actually move, where's the, where's the baby little craft? Oh, here it is. Um, let's move this painting. And we have to break it off the wall, the little border, borderless thing. Uh, let's move it, and let's just, let's just put it over here for right now, because I don't really have room on me. I think it's kind of funny how I said that. I don't have a room. I don't have the room to put it on. But yeah, I don't have the room, really, in my inventory for right now, so I'm, let's just leave that there. And then let's, I mean, I guess if we don't have, like, wooden counters, and we can't use the, the quartz ones... Could we just use these? Originally, we did have, like, oak wood counters. So, I mean, we could. So, let's start planning out, like, a little bit of area. We can have... We don't really have... Oh, no, we do have a sink. We have this, like, sink thing. Also, this sink, originally, if you saw in the last video, we made a the sink, but it was out of stone, and it kind of supposed to have this cool, like, modern texture to it. But every time I... I, I craft one, place it down, it just glitches out and gives us this oak wooden texture. So that's kind of fine, we're just gonna have to deal with that. So you know what? Let's put the sink in like the middle of the island. I kind of like how that looks. And then, you know, we could have like a fridge right here, maybe like a double fridge. That could be cool. And then we could have like a, 
like our ovens. Hmm. Because I kind of want like a cooktop and then wall ovens. I think that could be cool. Do we, what do we have for like an oven? Do we have an actual oven? Uh, dishwasher, um, washing machine, microwave, toaster. I don't see any ovens. Huh. That's weird. I thought that this mod came with an oven. Am I just not seeing it? This is strange. Oh, you know, here it is. Oven. Oh, that's a whole lot of iron. Okay. So, you know what? For right now, we're probably just going to use these furnaces as our ovens. Do not have a lot of iron. Well, I do have a lot of iron, but I don't have enough iron to just waste it on that. So, you know what? We could have, like, a double. We can move the fridge and have, like, a double cooktop space back here. And let's just make another... I need more cobblestone now. But we have to make another, um, another furnace. You know, to have a double one. And I mean, we have all these furnaces and stuff. I want, I want specific furnaces. Is that, is that plural furnaces? Or is it like furni? I don't know. If it's like cacti or like die, like dice. But, um, because we have all those furnaces right out of the, the chest room. Right out, outside of, I can't talk right, right outside of those doors. But, and they're right next to here. But I do kind of want our own you know, our own furnaces and stuff and ovens for the actual kitchen. So let's just take the oak wood, fill this bit back in here. And I mean, we could have like a triple. Let's, yeah, let's do a triple, a triple, um, like kitchen furnace slash oven stovetop thing. I kind of like how that looks. And then let's just have like this entire wall of like cabinets. No, but I don't like that idea anymore. Okay, so let's just put let's just put a little fridge here. We don't really have room for a pantry, but that's fine. We can just have a whole bunch of like uh, wall cabinets like this. And okay, so you know what? I do want like benches. So do they have like stools or something? I know they do. Oh, here they do. Oh, yeah. No, we're not gonna do that. I was gonna say I know that they do have them. I just don't know if they have them in this version. And we could make these. I kind of want to see a stone looks. Because I kind of feel like it's being more modern than just the wood. And also we have more cobblestone than like actual wood. So let's see how stone chairs look like. Oh, I got a mine key achievement. Okay, ooh. I kind of like how the stone ones look. It kind of blends in with the house just a little bit more. And makes it just feel like a little bit more. Like it's not, like things aren't just placed in here. Because I kind of want this place to kind of more or less be like a hidden modern mansion in like a mountainside. And not just like we someone built a house on a cliffside, you know. So I do kind of like how these chairs kind of blend in with the like the walls and stuff. So let's make a little cooktop, not cooktop, but like a like one of those steam catcher things. So we could make this just out of like out of stairs and walls, like cobblestone stairs and oh, cobblestone stairs and walls. I mean the original one was literally just like one cobblestone wall. So. I think pretty much anything we do is going to be an upgrade. So, you know what? We can have, like, those fancy ones where it's, like, an arch on top of it or something. You know, something like this, maybe. Let's take that down. I'm trying to break stair cobblestone stairs with an axe. Yep, because that's how it works. Um, so we can actually take these, turn them inwards, and then I guess just have, like, a little chimney going up. And let's replace this block with an actual full block of cobblestone. And then, you know what, we could have this going down like so. Um, not too sure about this and if I like it or not. Uh, no, I definitely don't like that. Let's see, let's make some more cobblestone stairs. And I actually, I do have enough while well, we're going through cobblestone like crazy. But that's fine, we have like, like what, 32 stacks in there and plus a couple more stacks. Um, I kind of like this though. I kind of like how there's like this separate bit here. And then there's like the actual archway of it. So it kind of blends in to the wall just a little bit too much. Eventually we're probably going to replace this with a little tile or something. I don't really know though. And um, you know what? How would it look if we had a... How do you make like a, a pressure plate in this version? Um, that's something I don't actually know. Let's look that up. That's really bad that I don't know this. But a pressure plate. Uh, oh. Oh, we need stone for that, then. We can't really do that right now. Um, I mean, we can do it. We just need to smelt two pieces. So let's... We don't have any coal on us. Well, we don't have anything on us anymore. But let's smelt two pieces of stone. 
well, two pieces of cobblestone to make stone. Let's just put all that in there. So we can get our pressure plate, because I do want, well, like, one pressure plate here or something. So it's kind of like a little bit of a cooktop. Um, and then, uh, like, a fridge. We need a fridge. So is there, like, a special kind of fridge? Ooh. There's deco craft fridges, and then there's a normal fridge. Oh. That's more expensive, but I do know that, that the Mr. Crayfish's fridge, like, the, um, those fridges, like, have certain abilities and stuff with them. So... What is that? Seven iron blocks. I think we can do that. That's gonna be a lot of iron. It really, really is. But who cares? We're gonna do it. And actually, I don't know if we can actually afford it. Uh, oh no. We have just, like, almost just enough. I'm just gonna throw some of those in there too. But we have, like, under half a stack now. So that is really bad and really dangerous that we don't have a lot of this stuff anymore because we're gonna need it in the future. We really are. What am I doing? I'm going crazy. Go ahead and pick this up, break that block, and make our little pressure plate. And oh, it kind of blends in. You know, that's fine. Is there some kind of cutting board? Because I do want to kind of have like some kind of cutting board laying on the counter. Ooh. Uh, ooh. Oh. And we're going to need one of those for the Pam's Harvest Craft. What is this? A robot? Okay, we're going to look into that eventually. But we're definitely going to need one of these cutting boards. Um because I know the cutting boards have like some kind of special ability when you're in the actual Pam's Harvest Craft mods and stuff and like when you're crafting the food. So what was it again? I wasn't really paying attention. Okay, so it's a stick in the middle, uh, one piece of wood on the bottom right and iron ingot on the top left and cutting board. And I think we actually place this. Like I think it's a placeable item. So let's just, let's just place like right here. Oh, there we go. And oh, kind of ask like a crafting table. That's kind of interesting. So you know what, let's make our little, um, let's make our little, let's take that stuff out. I probably shouldn't have put that in now because now we need more cobblestone, but it's fine. We have all this cobblestone here. Um, but yeah, let's just make our more furnaces. Well, it's just one furnace, but still, it's a furnace nonetheless. So let's make, um, the furnace. And then what else was it? I think it was a chest in the center. And we have just enough wood on us right now. Um, and then, so there's chest in the center furnace and then seven blocks of iron that's like the most expensive recipe i've ever made in minecraft so yeah that's that's saying something and oh i was gonna say can i not even place it down and i kind of like i kind of do like the iron block shield look of this texture pack but also i kind of don't like how it looks on this fridge but i don't really know i kind of like how it adds like a certain texture to it so let's just place a um plank down there and oh freezer and fridge so we can store stuff in the fridge so that'd be good for like the raw meats and stuff and the eggs and i know the freezer if we take the freezer and we take um we take i think it's coal and rotten flesh i know that sounds really really weird but if we take some rotten flesh and let's just steal some coal out of this furnace and run back over to our little kitchen um i think like coal or fuel there and then the rotten flesh that's not going. Oh, no, I think we need, like, an ice pack or something. So let's go back to the Mr. Crayfish's per, uh, furniture mod. And it's, like, an ice pack. Oh, it's soap? Maybe not soap. Um, One of these things. It has to be around here. I remember this. Oh, yeah, cooked flesh. You smell, the like, the flesh flesh, which is rotten flesh, but turned to normal. And then you can make leather out of it, I believe, it, when you craft it. So... We can have a chopping board from Mr. Crayfish's furniture mod, and I think it has, like, a certain texture to it that actually looks better, so we may, we may do that then, but I'm not seeing this. Oh, here it is, the cooling pack. Oh. Can't, I don't know if we can do that right now, so we're not gonna do that. It's fine. We'll just leave. Actually, no. I'm not leaving anything half done. So let's just go get a, um, what was it, a bucket and some glass. Why am I, I keep running up. Hi, little dog. We still have to name you, but I keep running up to the second floor to get the stuff because it's, like... That's where I'm so used to, um, finding everything. Maybe that's where we, like, always... Where's my buckets? But that's where we always used to run up to, like, actually get the stuff. Because that's where we used to store. That's definitely not creepy at all. Whatever that scary noise was. I'm just gonna get this glass and just run in. There's no glass in there. So I'm just gonna run. And we need sand. Uh, let's just get a stack of sand and we'll just run. Because, oh my god, let me in. Because that was one, so I'm getting like shivers and goosebumps because that was a scare, that was really, that was one scary noise. And I like scary stories and like 
things like that. So when I say that's a scary noise, you know I mean it. Um, yeah, so I think we needed eight. Oh, a cookie jar. We could make that as obsidian or, okay, that's just black wool. And a blender. We gotta make all of this stuff. So let's, um, we have glass. Let's just get, I, I don't know if it's like color, like wool color specific. I know we had wool somewhere. I just went to collect some from the sheep before. My question is, where did I put it? Oh, here it is. Um, let's see if we can use white wool. And then let's just get some, um, some more of these glass panes. These normal glass panes. Because I know we need them for, like, a cookie jar or something. And let's just take this glass to, uh, we need only three more pieces. So we'll just wait for that. And then let's come over here and craft this. Um, so which one should we do first? Let's do the cookie jar. So it's, um, wool on the top. And then glass panes. Oh, okay, so it is color um, specific. So let's just go get some, uh, some ink sacks. Or I think there is actually, like, a black dye. I want to, I want to see that. So, where was this thing? Because I can, it just makes my life faster. Um, see, black dye. Oh. Oh! We're gonna do that, because that gives us, like, eight more dye pieces. So it's one redstone, one glass bottle... And I have a whole bunch of the glass bottles, and I need food. I have a whole bunch of the glass bottles from, like, the whole, um... Oh, what was it called? Like, you know those, uh, Legend of Zelda tombs? And then we have a whole bunch of redstone, obviously, from, like, mining and stuff. And you get, you get, like, at least four pieces from one piece of ore. So it's really a good deal for that. Um, and then black roses. We only need one. And we have seven. And we probably have some growing up in the whole, like, um, farm upstairs. I do know I grow a whole bunch of flowers. I have like a specific area just for flowers in like the center of the farm. So let's just run back over here and um, let's craft this dye uh, glass bottle, redstone, and black roses, and eight ink sacks. That's actually a really, really good deal. So let's just dye all of that wool. And then um, black wool on the top, three on the bottom, uh, glass, glass. And then I think it was iron in the middle. Okay, got that wrong. How do you make the blender? Oh, it's glass panes, and it's four on either side. Okay, there we go. That's interesting. Um, let's just place this down, like, the right there in the corner. Kind of like that. I love the whole stained glass look. And if I needed panes, why did I make glass? All right, for the cooling pack. Okay, yeah, let's do that right now. So it's eight glass all around like this. And then, ooh. We can make a tank from Buildcraft Factory. That's interesting. Um, we're definitely going to get... Oh, we got two of those from that. But we're definitely going to have to get into that whole Buildcraft thing um, in a future video soon. Oh, I love the whole snow snowflake look. Um, and yeah, okay. So let's make our cookie jar now. And I think it was just glass paints on the bottom. Oh, yes. Good. Cookie jar. Uh, let's place that there. Oh, can we actually place cookies in it? Let's make some cookies. I don't, I don't normally craft cookies in Minecraft because they're like really garbagey. You know, I never need them. But you know, we have the ingredients. It's just wheat and then cocoa beans. And I'm not seeing any cocoa beans in here. So you know what? Let's sleep. Set the time today, which I think it will be. It's either turning night time or turning like morning. I don't really know. But let's just sleep. By the way, I think it's turning morning because I can see the sun rising in front of my bed. Um, but yeah, so let's just sleep, and then, well, we already slept, but let's run upstairs and go to our farm, which we haven't actually really, like, looked at and explored in a little while. Um, cocoa beans right here, and we have a whole bunch now. I think I actually put all the cocoa beans either in this chest or in these, the, oh, nope, there's no cocoa beans in here. Then all the cocoa beans must be in the, uh, chest room, either in, like, dyes or, like, environment, I don't really know. Let's just run back to the kitchen, and I wish there was, like, an elevator in this house, just, like, from the third floor to the first floor. It really would be nice, but, you know, it's fine. Um, and then cocoa beans, and I think it's three wheat. I don't even know how to make cookies. This is bad. Uh, I've been playing Minecraft for years and years and years now. Oh, there's another way to craft a cookie jar, but we're not gonna do that. But I've been playing Minecraft for years and years and years and years, and ooh, I like that more. And we don't have this stuff to make it. But I've been playing Minecraft for years and years and years again, I say. But, um, I still don't know how to make cookies. Oh, okay, so it's it's not three wheat, it's two wheat. And it makes eight cookies. Did not know that. Oh, oh my god, they have, like, a cute little, like, 3 texture. Oh, okay, so it only puts six in. You know, that's kind of fine. I like how it actually shows them. 
Um, okay, so let's see. Oh, we have normal flesh. Okay, that actually lasts, that lasts about 12 pieces. So one pack lasts about 12 pieces. So let's just go get another 12 pieces. Well, actually, because there's one in there, let's just get, you know, it's fine. Who cares? Let's just get all of them and see what we can turn into uh, like normal flesh and what we can't is I'd rather not waste that whole ice pack thing. And then I think we smelt this in our kitchen furnace of all things. <laughs> um, and then let's go back to the whole uh, Mr. Crayfish furniture mod. Okay, so we have a mailbox. We should definitely do that in a moment. Um, we already have a knife in the chest. We have some cups. Let's try making, I know we can make, we can make like juices and stuff from the blender, but I think we need like a book or something here. Um, oh, we can make a fire alarm. We need to make one of those so the house doesn't burn down. Oh, there's a, there's already an oven overhead in this mod and ink cartridges and stuff. Oh, this is just crazy. But we don't exactly have time to focus on everything right now. So I think we're just going to do the kitchen. So you know what? We need a bin. So two weighted pressure plates and stone and then iron. We are everything in this kitchen is just gonna be made of iron and it's not necessarily a bad thing it's just you know we're kind of running low on the whole iron thing right now but that's kind of fine um so on the top and then iron on the bottom and i think this basically works as you can actually like throw things out and actually like press a button where it just gets rid of them so let's put it over here and oh like that how that looks with the whole oh get yourself cleaned up I didn't even read the achievement, but I like how the actual the thing looks. And you know what? We have to move this crafting table somewhere. So let's just put it like right here. I mean, we can have two of them. We can have one there. And then let's make another one with wood that we do not have. Um, let's just make another one and place it like right here. Um, so it's kind of like evenly positioned um, from the ovens and cooked flesh. And I think... I think we can make leather out of this. Please tell me I am correct. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Please don't tell me you eat this. No, please don't tell me it's a food source. Oh, what in the world? Please don't tell me it's a food source. Oh, no. I think it might be a food source. Ew. No. I, th I thought you could make leather. Ew, 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 ew. I'm just gonna throw this in this chest and never touch it again. But, um, speaking of, like, chests and storage and stuff, let's break away one of these. And let's pick up the whole kitchen cabinet. Where is it? Oh, we need those cups. But where is the whole kitchen cabinet? I'm not seeing it. I don't want this stuff to despawn. Is it not already in my inventory? Oh, no, here it is. Okay, um... Okay, so let's just break these ones, too. Well, we have to be really fast and super speedy about this because I don't want the items to despawn. So let's just place the cabinets on this side. And let's kind of just place them above. Actually, you don't, wouldn't normally have a cabinet above your fridge. So let's just continue that over. And I mean, some people do, but it's more of those cabinets that's like, um, you know, those cabinets where it's like a half cabinet. And you know what? These these glasses, we could just place down and pretend like someone was like drinking out of them or something. I like how that looks. Um, and then also save us space. So let's dump things like uh, like a fish and a chicken and something else that goes in freezers, like eggs and stuff. Eggs normally goes in freezers. Um, why can't I play? Oh, I guess only food can go in there. Technically, it's a decoration item. So let's put. Oh, we have a whole bunch of coal that we can place in those furnaces. But let's just kind of throw everything in here that thing's actually supposed to go in here so we have let's have this let's have this cabinet so it's like all the pam harvest craft and like buckets and things and glasses glasses and knives and things like that should go in here so it's like utilitary items um so let's break these glasses and actually let's break this cutting board because i kind of want to switch it out for the mr crayfish cutting board so um, we'll have like a pam's harvest craft line and then we can have like Mr. Crayfish line and random stuff. Um, let's dump some of the stuff in here that we don't really need and we're out of space once again. That's really bad. But, um, yeah, let's just try to super speed this up because I would rather not every have everything spawn. So we can have, like, fruit in there. Then we can have, did not mean to throw that on the ground, but we can have, like, vegetables and, like, things like squash and asparagus and artichoke and sugar cane, I guess, can go in there. And those seeds should not be in there. Um, cocoa beans will kind of go to miscellaneous. And actually, crops should be in a different one. But it's fine. We'll just throw everything in here for right now. 
Um, and then let's just continue picking this stuff up. Because I'd rather not have this stuff despawn. Um, and then cantaloupes are fruit. We have... All this stuff would go in here. Uh, carrots, cucumbers. We need, like, a mushroom area, but I guess... I guess that could go in here, too. So we have mushrooms. What mushrooms? M normal, like, red mushrooms. And then these eggs would go in the... Oh. Why can I... Okay, I guess I can only put, like, poultry items in the fridge. Salt would also go in here. A bakeware and things like that. And then also I know we have, like, a juicer, I believe. Or no, a mixing bowl. Uh, mixing bowls will go in there. And I'm um, kind of running out of room. But, you know, things like... Um, Apples and grapes and scallions would go in here. Apples and grapes and scallions, oh my. Sugar would go in here. Um, mushrooms would go... Actually, mushrooms could go in the other chest. And oh, this is a mess. I'm just like freaking out, hoping that this stuff will not... Um, will not despawn. Because if it does, we are going to be in one big heck of a problem. And we're almost done. Why is there a bamboo shoot? I do not want to sit in the chair. The bamboo shoots do not be- And there's more stuff in here. Oh, great. The bamboo shoots do not be long in the kitchen. They're not food. They're like saplings, I guess. Um, fruit, fruit, pumpkins, fruit, and then mushrooms. Don't really go in there. We have to make more of these cabinets. Um, zucchini would go in here. Um... Yeah, okay, so the mushrooms we're gonna have to wait off on, but we have avocados, sesame seeds, more carrots, kiwi, and we have pineapples, and a whole bunch of eggs. I don't really want to eat those eggs, like these eggs. Oh, and a curly leaf? I've never even heard of, of a curly leaf. What is that? I, I mean, I guess it's a leaf that's curly, but <laughs> can I elaborate? Well, can someone help me elaborate? Because I have no idea. I've never even heard of that. Would an avocado be- why is there pineapples in there? Oh, no, that's a fruit chest. I mean, I guess, I'm not a huge fan of avocados, so I don't really know, but I guess avocados would be considered a vegetable. And, oh my god, we'll just eat that carrot. We already have a full stack of carrots in here. And then we can have, like, sesame seeds, mushroom. Actually, we should have, like, a miscellaneous section. Um, so we, crops and stuff can go in there. Uh, yeah, okay, so let's make another one of those. Another one of those cabinets, because they really are helpful, and they provide a lot of space. It's just, you know, we need... We need wood for it, which wood we do not have. So, kind of a little bit of a problem. We do- oh, there's barley here. But we do need to start some kind of, like, oak wood, like, farm of just, like, oak wood trees. Because it's, a like, a big dying thing around our area. Because there's no oak wood trees, like, on this island at all. And what is this called? It's just a cabinet. Oh, okay. That's really simple. It's just a chest in the center. That's the only thing that's kind of a little bit more annoying. A chest and then you know oak wood planks around and we have another cabinet we should probably make two of those because there's space for two and stuff but you know it's fine so we'll have like crops in here and then we'll have also like things like mushrooms not oak wood oak wood is not food and then we'll have like um uh you know what we'll have our own chest full of miscellaneous stuff which would include mushrooms and kind of overflow items i guess that's like this is hmm Kind of feel like this should be utilities, so that should be taken out, and then we'll have another cabinet, which is like overflow and miscellaneous. So we need another chest, and then just in the center, and then another surrounding of oak wood planks, and that is it. And this one should be things like eggs, and sugar and salt, and mushrooms, and cocoa beans, and and sesame seeds and curry leaves, things I don't really know where they're supposed to be long and I guess cookies could go in there too because it's like a full food and then carrots and stuff gets an overflow item and mushrooms and is that all the food? I think that is all of the food, it seems like it. Um, I mean I guess we should put the egg basket decoration pieces in here for right now and wow we did a decent amount in this video and we pretty much come to a close now. Oh, we can actually dispose of items. Oh, do I... Oh, that is really cool, and I love the sound effect. I could do that all day. But yeah, we've come to a... We will come to a stop of this video, and we did a humongous... Let's just remove this, because this is going to keep annoying me. But um, we did a humongous... And is, is that sunrise or sunset? 
I get so easily distracted by seeing that sunset. So I guess it's the perfect time to end this video. But we did a humongous, humongous amount. I want to take my armor off for this. We did a humongous amount of stuff in this video in the whole kitchen area. I know we didn't do as much as we normally do in these 30 minute videos um, for Minecraft Chronicles, but you know, we did do a decent amount in the whole, actually, kitchen department because that's all, all we really did. But yeah, guys, I really hope you guys liked this video. If you did, make sure you leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already because it really does help me out. And yeah, thank you all for watching all the way through if you have. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!